See where this goes. So that's good news if they didn't feel it. 3 2 Phillies, top four. And this team has hit for a lot more power. After a busy couple of innings to start this game, that still can be a valuable pitch for him. Springer racing. Fastball grounded to short. Clement has it. And a very good throw to Horwood. I hope we look better than that. Marginally. <laughs> Brandon Marsh with a base hit. He is two for two. The batter. And you can see again kind of a long the catcher hole. back there and give him a chance. <laughs> Last That's month or so, too. yeah. That's a great point. <laughs> Down and in. Two. Swing and a miss. Throw down to first, but a back first is bat today. Took a fastball out to right in the second inning. For those who don't know and are wondering, we didn't mention. One ball, two strikes. One, two. Up and away. At first, two down. He is running. And the pitch is in the air to center field, not deep. Dalton Varsho is there, and the Philly. It's short. Jimenez over to second. Bouncer to third, and charging Sosa. Sosa's kind of the Clement of the Phillies. Second, short, third. Very uh, similar, similar role. skill set, the two guys. Spencer Horwitz sees it. Off away. And a swing and a miss. Four strikeouts, three ground outs. So now. And continues numbers over the last 21 games. A 982 OPS. To make his move to the baseball. A little soft liner to first, caught by Clemens. Kyle Schwarber, two for two with a homer. Fairly straightforward. Four for a homer, three for a triple, two for a double, one for a distance sink. of the record. As a Dodger against the Brewers, so that's 19 total Five bases in the, in the total bases department. Good thing it didn't go extra innings. Yeah. Double play. That was started by Vladimir Guerrero Jr. There's a curve. But you'd still like Jump to splitter. You can still mix those in to be more of that four pitch repertoire. And this split is popped up down the right field line. And this is grounded up the middle and waiting for it is Leo Jimenez. Two down. Hit by pitch that he suffered in the first. There's a the slide early. Swing. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. Got, I mean, if you're going to skip out on school on day two, you might want to look. Slider misses off the. Another slider. Change up. Uh, and a fastball got out for Sanchez. This one hit well left field and off the wall. Servin is on his way to second base and big cut and a foul consecutively. Change up away. That's and a ground ball to stop the second baseman who will throw Springer. Two and oh. I give you a And he got the slider and he hooked it foul. against Bowden Francis. Castellanos a base hit and a. Pulled down to third. Guerrero drops it, picks it up, and has the arm to make. You know, whether it is. So uh, on, but they are certainly giving him a look over there. It's an option there. Popped up by Bryson Stott. Shallow right. 
Springer coming in to make the catch. JT Real Muto with a bouncer to third. Guerrero's got it on to first. Settled in very nicely. And a foul. Without an active pitcher in the bullpen, I can't imagine he's done. A ground ball to second as Guerrero is retired. You don't see a whole lot of that going on when a pitcher's still in the ball game. Brandon Marsh leading off the lefty right. next inning makes sense. Cody Clemens batting third unless Rob Thompson goes to his bench but with a one run lead. Don't think so. Alejandro Kirk pulls one down to third Sosa's got it and the throw in time for out number two. It's a good play. Very nice play Sosa in the ball game. At third base Cody Clemens moved over to first but he takes extra bases away from Kirk with this one. So a couple of quick outs and here is Ernie Clement. And he'll swing at the first pitch fly ball to center Marsh back but he's got room. And that's that a three up 